A genuine congratulations to Vivian and her team for hell of a boss and winning the streamies. At the end of the day, streamies and all that shit doesn't really matter, but like at the end of the day, I think like this is very much deserved. Vivian and her team have been working hard, animating, just voice acting, all that other shit. Like they've done a pretty well job. Like hell of a boss is one of the first series to explode in this capacity. Like it's reached the mainstream and it's something you can't like overlook. It's something that should be praised because a youtuber is doing this shit like it's amazing and that's not to discredit any other past series like um say leo and satan like there's other people from the past like uh flash gets uh ego raptor oni g there's a lot of other people um from the past who have like got their fair share of like credibility and like explosion from these animations it's just that like a full-on series it usually doesn't go that well and vivian is proving the youtube algorithm wrong regardless of how you feel about vivian and hell of a boss i think that's absolutely amazing and it's a staple in the youtube community especially the animation community like she's she's paved a way for other creators to sort of like follow suit and also be recognized i'm not trying to be ignorant and say she did it alone in any sense like her and her team did it alone in any sense no that's not the case because there's animations animation was kind of like growing it used to be this kind of niche on youtube but now it's like growing with shorts and the way um algorithm works now it's like growing more and more but like she just kind of ballooned the whole idea more and yeah i just personally wanted to give a full-on congratulations because you genuinely deserve this you guys deserve this win i'm very much proud of you even though i'm fucking nobody obviously but like i'm very i'm very very proud of you <laughs> keep doing what you're doing and don't let anybody else tell you how to create your show or create art also that's another thing i kind of want to talk about because twitter people like i know i know they're twitter people or x people i should call them holy shit oh but the people who are just like oh let me fix your art let me fix your creation or um oh you should do this instead of this like they don't know what the fuck they're talking about and it irritates me because it's not criticism saying what you dislike what you like about it praises problems that is criticism and explaining your thought process of why you don't like this that is criticism saying how you can fix something that is not that's legitimately you're you're just trying to play god i don't know <laughs> you're basically telling people how to do their job and to rework their brain in order to fit your needs like no you can say what you dislike about any product ever but when you say you need to fix something for my needs that's fucked up that's not okay it's just people like that who irritate the fuck out of me because they think they're giving criticism but they're actually just chatting they're just basically telling you how to run the shit and with people's attention span being so fucking low nowadays i feel like people just hyper focus on one specific thing that they find wrong and don't talk about anything else they don't talk about anything else they dislike they they don't talk about the goods they don't talk about they don't talk about any of that they just hyper focus this one idea and they're just like yep this whole thing is tainted now like what the fuck y'all don't love art y'all don't love creativity y'all just like being heard just say it anyway that's all i gotta say how's it going pups it's a canine and i'm out